Falcon. Taurus. Taurus. It is the last week of May. Your zodiac energy is over until next year. What is happening, Taurus? Please remember to share these videos. Okay. Do not look at the meaning of the videos because sometimes there's other information that is in the videos because I realize that people just look at the name of the videos. But sometimes there is a whole lot in the videos that you need to um, know a whole lot of information. So whatever is going on and trans transpiring Tauruses, you gotta just listen to the video. Please like and share these videos, okay? I'm hoping that you guys are okay. All right, there is, um, this week is from the 23rd until the um, 31st, okay? So, however this is happening in transpiring Tauruses, be on the lookout, be on the watch. Remember to subscribe, thumbs up these videos, share, 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 subscribe, and thumbs up. Let's see what is coming up for you, Tauruses. So, I see a week of some regrets is coming in for you, Tauruses. Okay, on Monday, on Tuesday, you're protecting yourself from whatever that energy was. A tower moment is coming down on Wednesday. On Thursday, I see some boredom. On Friday, I see the burdens are over that you were carrying, which is good. On Saturday, I see you young people in the reverse. It's like you have to study. And I see you're turning your back to a relationship. Wow. Tauruses. 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 So, Tauruses. All right. So, Monday is very emotion. Tuesday, you're protecting yourself. Wednesday, a huge something is releasing from your life. Thursday, you have um, this situation as... Uh, um regrets or boredom um friday your burdens is going to be over and i see you young ladies are ending a relationship and turning your back on this relationship so what we see is there is no love in this week you're not open to love whatever is to inspire because i see you young ladies are very very turning your back you are just focusing on yourself whatever is to inspire especially the young ladies um you're just um focusing on yourself okay so um um something is going to be leaving and handing out of your life tauruses whatever needs to leave let it go i see you're protecting yourself and that is very good some of you um if you have a situation with a leo i see that this person is going to be leaving your life so the regrets i see some issues come back from the past and you're regretting this and um it has to do with an ex so if you tauruses was in a relationship with a scorpion i see this issue come back from the past and it has to do with an ex and um you you do really don't want to deal with it but it's coming up i see some of you taurus is trying to protect your money if some money was stolen this money is going to be returned so i see a pisces cancer or a scorpion is going to be helping you in order to um, return some money. I see a Pisces Cancer Scorpion is trying to reconnect. I see a Tower Moment is coming down and it has to be with an Aquarian, Gemini or Libra or there could be some legal issue um, and it has to be with a new love. So it is a situation where you Tauruses, I see a past life issue. So there is definitely a past life issue that is transpiring by, by Tauruses. A past life issue is um, with a, um, a Leo and I see justice come in and is removing this Leo and I see that this was an ex um, relationship some of you are dealing with uh, a Pisces cancer or a scorpion this was an ex also that an issue come back you're trying to protect yourself but I see these people and the situation is moving away because it has to do with some of you have lost a lot of money because of a new love that comes in your life or because of your child so whatever is happening tauruses i see this happening i see issues with family um and you are worried and i see no success no celebration if you notice all emotional situation is in reverse 
I see that this fire side has created some burden for you. Whoever this man is, whether your husband or your wife has stolen some money and created some burdens, financial issue with a fire sign person. I see you ladies, money is going to be coming in and I see you ladies are turning your back on a, a love, okay? Because you found out the lies and deceptiveness of uh, um, your boss of offer. Uh, and um, a fire sign man, some deceptiveness, what this fire sign man has done. Some of you are ending a contract. Um, uh, some of you are wants to end a contract with a fire sign man, whoever this fire sign man is, or in a relationship. I see whatever financial hardship you have is going to be over. So I see a lot of information is coming out also about a Virgo. Whoever this Virgo is, I see some deceptiveness is coming out about this Virgo. So some of you have some issue you're dealing with with a um some emotional issue with a cancer. Whoever this cancer is, I see a cancer and a Leo is going to be removed out of your life. However, this is coming up because I see because of some investigation, they find out something about this person. So I see they're investigating a cancer and a, a, um, a fire sign businessman. And I see they're not going to be successful. Um, whoever this cancer is, they're, a tall moment is coming down on a cancer. So if you're connected with a cancer, whether it was your partner, or with someone in business, a tall moment is coming down because this cancer had carried some burden for you, financial burdens for you. And I see this cancer is being removed out of your life. Some of you were dealing with, uh, um, it could have been your, your father for some of you young ladies, some of you older ladies, it could be your husband. And I see um, you're ending this. You don't want to deal with this because you realize that this man is very deceptive and this man hasn't been speaking the truth. And I see you're ending this whole connection. So it could have been your child father or for some of you, it could have been your father. And I see you do not want to collaborate with this person because the energy of love is in um, the reverse. The Ace of Cups is in the reverse. Some of you realize that... Uh, Whoever this new love is that came in your life was being very deceptive and you're seeing the truth about this person. So Taurus says, I see, um, it's as if you're waking up and you ladies, um, you ladies have given or a businessman has stolen a lot from you and they're now seeing the deceptiveness of who this businessman is. It's as if this businessman said that you both had a contract and they see that there was no contract there's no connection between you and this business person so let's see what is happening and what is transpiring young ladies young unmarried ladies i see you're protecting yourself i see um an ex come back that you have to be dealing some emotional situation with and some uh, situation with money and i see um, that you are protecting yourself from this person and this situation. I see some of you stand strong, whatever the issue and the situation is that some of you are dealing with a cancer, um, whoever this cancer is and whatever this cancer has done, um, they have taken a lot of money from you. They should have paid you some money. The money wasn't paid. Now people are seeing the truth that this cancer had lied to you. Now, whatever is transpiring for unmarried women, um, a situation with a Leo who has stolen a lot of money. This money is going to be returned to you because they see the lies and deceptiveness of this young unmarried Leo woman. Um, what she has done. I see you Tauruses are going to be celebrating. I see you Tauruses realize the lies and deceptiveness from this person. Maybe this person was a new love that came in your life. You um 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 you have stability against this new love. Whoever this person was, was a cancer who came into your lives. And this person have a lot of secrets and deceptiveness that is coming up. I see a huge blow up, twice a tower moment that is going to be transpiring. Where I see a Pisces and a cancer could be leaving your life. A Pisces and a cancer could be leaving your life. And I see that some of you are going to be happy because whatever they have done, 
um, the truth is coming out and people are seeing the truth to what the Pisces and Cancer has done. And I see truths are coming out. So I see the energy of burdens. Some of you had some burdens that was created by a fire sign man, whoever this fire sign man is. I see your fortune is going to be returned. This fire sign man tries to steal or take something. Some of you were having some burdens to deal with your boss, but I see this is over. A message is going to be coming in, and this message is a message of help that is going to be coming in for some of you because they have realized what this fire sign man has done. I see a situation with a corporation institution. I see some of you young ladies are focusing on studying and because some of you have exam. I see some of you young ladies are ending relationships so you can focus on your study, your work. Um, you ladies also are, uh, could be um, going to buy a house. I see a friend is going to be coming in. I see some of you are going to be finding out about some deceptiveness, some lies, um, and it has to do with a friend. Truths are coming out about a friend that you were working with and the lies and deceptiveness. A message is going to be coming in um, from an ex, whoever this ex is. Um, it could be a businessman, and this was your ex or someone where you used to work um this person had cancer this person wants to reconnect so i see um a text message could be coming in this is a form of a text message that is going to be coming in from a businessman um this man cares about you i i, I see that this person is, is a pleasure seeking it's as if this person really um this person care about you but this person was a friend and you found out some lies about this person and this person is trying to reconnect with you some pleasure seeking and you're like uh, yeah this co-worker is very false it could be a co-worker but it could be a very deceptive man whoever this man is that is trying to send you text message and that sort of a thing and you know this person is just looking for a whip a whipping in and out in bed don't do it don't connect with this person this person is not really honest um whoever this person is it could be a businessman who wants to connect with you and you have no intention in connecting with this person this person is very false this person is a fox so it's an ex co worker who wants and start texting you and that sort of a thing you do not want to have anything to do with this person so whoever this person is because they're coming up and it's as if this person is showing you love or you know is trying to, to say you know i really care about your will false this person is so false keep this person away from you whoever um this person is is very false um you have to understand that sometimes you leave a company or a business and someone could have lied to you but Sometimes it's not for the right reason. This person just wants a one night stand. Okay, if you're in for the one night stand, go for it. If you're not, uh, let this person go because this person is very false. So I see regrets. I some see some of you have some regrets dealing with a scorpion. Some of you are protecting yourself from the scorpion, protecting your money. I see that this is a karmatic issue, but I see some of you stand your grounds. So I see um. Um, once you were in love with someone, but this love is over because whoever this new love is that is coming in for some of you ladies, especially you business ladies, this person is only coming in because of money. So keep this person at arm's length. I see an investigation or some information is coming out about a child. Some of you are having issues with your child and some information is going to be coming out about your child. It's a bittersweet information, and this information is very bittersweet. I see the family is connecting with you and is uh, letting you know. So some of you are going to be receiving a letter from a family member, or some of you are going to be receiving a bittersweet um, information. It's coming from a cancer. Whoever this cancer is and whatever is transpiring, this cancer is a family member or someone you were seeing, okay? So it is bittersweet emotions that is coming up. And some of you have to be aware of this. Now, the burdens that a fire sign man has created, it could have been your boss. Whatever this burden is, I see truths are going to be coming out. 
So again, you young ladies regretted a situation, but I see success is going to be coming in. And what I'm seeing is that some of you stand strong um, with a situation with your partner or your ex-lover. Some of you, I see that they find out that a Leah person has taken a lot from you. And I see the truth is coming out. A huge tower moment is coming down for a Leo and a Cancer. Whoever this Leo and this Cancer is, I see a huge tower moment coming down for them. Some of you, you have some regrets ever have contacted or whoever this um, businessman is. Um, some of you, you have some issues with your boss. Some of you, you're going to be receiving a letter from a friend that is going to be advising you and telling you and informing you about a deceptive businessman. I see the energy of uh, some of you ladies who are doing business. I see someone is pleasure seeking. This person is very deceptive. Stay away from this person. This person can be a Gemini or this person uh, can be a Gemini. And this person is pleasure seeking with you. Let it go. Have nothing to do with this person because this person is a, a very deceptive uh, co-worker ex co-worker or co-worker so be aware i see some of you young ladies are going to be receiving some message maybe from a company asking you back maybe for your boss asking you back or whether this is transpiring um but i see someone is asking um for to connect with you and it's coming in as a text message all right so this week you guys have admit your truth feel your true feelings to yourself be honest with yourself only you know what is uh, um, truly desired okay so this is a situation where some of you whatever is transpiring happened purple seems to be coming up for a lot of people in this week so I guess this week energy is the energy of purple um, spirituality healing okay and whatever is happening and transpiring I see a whole lot of healing is going to be coming up and you guys have to be honest with yourself. It's a week to be honest with yourself, okay? Because you are the only one who knows what it is that you want. I love you guys. I am saying namaste. Until next time.